There are roughly 130 nuclear submarines in the world, vessels that are powered by nuclear reactors. But what happens when it's time to decommission one of these submarines? For submarines in the United States, which is most nuclear subs, the Navy has set up the Ship Submarine Recycling Program. Though preparations can begin anywhere, all nuclear subs must be properly decommissioned at the Puget Sound Naval Shipyard in Washington State. The spent nuclear fuel is removed and shipped to the Naval Reactor Facility at the Idaho National Laboratory to be safely stored, but beyond that, the process is pretty mundane. The submarine is cut into four pieces, the forward section, the aft, the reactor compartment, and the missile compartment if the sub had one. The reactor compartments are sent to Hanford Nuclear Reservoir to be kept in dry storage and eventually buried. The remaining pieces of the submarine are reused if possible, otherwise they're cut into scrap metal and either repurposed by the Navy or sold to private companies. 